Craft Geek just sent me their brand new Bravo music stand. And you may be thinking, what's so special about a music stand? Why are you gonna do an unboxing review for just a music stand? Well, you could see here, it folds up into a really compact design. And I'm sure a lot of you have seen those wireframe music stands that fold up and those are not the greatest. They always get knocked over. You can't hold your books and everything starts falling everywhere. Supposedly, this Craft Geek Bravo music stand solves those issues and retains the sturdiness of a high quality music stand in a small compact package. Let's bust into this thing and see if it lives up to the hype. Full disclosure here, Craft Geek did send me this for free to review, but you guys know I'm always gonna be 100% honest with you on the channel here to make sure that these products really live up to what they say they're gonna do. So let's pop this open and check it out. There we go. Stand in here. Let's get that out of there. Right away I can feel this the metal that it's made out of seems really dense, really high quality. A little heavier than I thought it would be, which is I think a good thing. Shows for the sturdiness of the design. Feels really compact. Let's see if we can figure this out without reading the instructions to see about the ease of use. So it looks like here we've got a locking mechanism. So you just loosen that up and then unfold this. And then you're gonna wanna tighten this again when you get your desired angle for the stand so your books don't fall everywhere. It's a good design choice there. Then it looks like these are our tripod legs. So we have this locking mechanism as well to get our tripod out. You can adjust it and then it looks like tighten this again to get these tripod feet locked in place excellent and then let's set it down on the floor and see how high we can get this thing to go all right goes up really high you can't even see it on the camera anymore so that's great i didn't actually expect it to be able to go up this high let's move it down a little more so you guys can see here then we have our stand here. Let's see how this opens up. We've got our wings there for the music. And then we can peel these off of here. A little bit of a grippy surface to keep your music secure. And these flip out here. And then it looks like this turns so we can fully hold all our music on there. And then we can tilt this back. See, it goes back pretty far. I know most musicians have a music stand already, except for whatever reason, guitar players tend to not have one and they're hurting their neck looking down at the table or their bed all the time. So it might be a good idea to pick one up if you guys don't have a music stand yet. Feels very sturdy. Definitely not gonna fall over if it gets whacked or anything. Feels really sturdy, pretty nice like that. Let's see how it is if we throw a book on here. Here we go. And we got these little clips here. Pretty convenient to keep your books on there. Let's see. So we're knocking the stand around pretty crazy and our book is staying really secure. So that's a great sign. You can also, if you have something like this, something bigger, you can flip it out. These little arms here actually extend. So because I have a larger book here, you can extend the arms of the music stand and get it in there. Perfect fit, this is a pretty wide book. As you can see, the music isn't going anywhere. Let's get it up on the table here so you guys can see the legs and know that I'm not pulling your leg. Overall, I'm gonna be honest, I love the feel of the metal on here. It just feels really high quality. You could tell right away that this stand is gonna last a long time. It's not gonna fall apart or anything like that. Um, Craft Geek is a California-based company, so I know a lot of you guys like USA-based companies. And we do have some accessories for the stand that they sent me as well. 
real quick, if you guys are interested in this stand, feel free to check out the link code in the description. You can use my code Mitch Avedon to get a nice discount on this stand. Just check out the link in the description. They also have these available. So first one we've got here, this one is called a flexi mount and it looks like what we have is a phone mount. So if you're working on some music and you wanna have your phone for whatever reason, playing some background music or giving you some more information for while you're playing, you can use this little guy to help out. Let's see. All right, comes in two parts here. Looks like we just screw one end into the phone holder has a rotating angle and actually it looks like the stand here has a screw where we can put the other end all right that goes on pretty easy and now let's i'm gonna grab my phone real quick so we can see if it fits all right let's see how's it? oh goes in nice and easy holds the phone pretty secure yep uh, that's not going anywhere so you don't have to worry about the safety of your phone there and then let's see pop it open pretty easily i like the grips here on the side you can tell it's going to keep your phone nice and secure and the, another cool thing is this thing goes at all kinds of different angles so you can have it moved around whatever way you want whichever way you want to see your phone it's definitely going to work for anything like that and then we got one more accessory here this one is called the lumilite this is a light for your music stand if you're playing somewhere dark. I love how compact all of these fold up into. So the light folds out. Then we got a little, I think this is a battery pack, but we have a USB-C port as well. Or you can use batteries. So we got a spot for three AA batteries in there. So I've got the light plugged in here. Um, it either needs to be plugged in with USB-C or have the three AA batteries to get power. And we do have a little switch here, three different settings. We got off and then we got level one light and level two light. So you can see it gets pretty bright for just this little guy. The light here is really powerful. It's hard to look at, so definitely don't point it in your eyes. And then let's see how it attaches to the stand here. So what's pretty neat about all these products is they have all these little spots for accessories. So you can actually screw this right on for the music stand. If it's out of my lights here, let's see how bright it gets. Pretty bright on level one, really brightens up the whole thing on level two brightness there. So you're gonna be able to read your music. So there you have it guys. There's the whole Craft Geek stand set up with all its accessories. I think it's pretty fun how it has all these little attachments that can go along with it. I haven't really seen a music stand before that has all these attachments and accessories that you can fold up in a compact way. I think that's pretty awesome. And then we also have this little carrying case that can fit everything in it. So let's open that up. Let's make sure it all fits in here. Lock it back into place. So the bag in here has some compartments so you can fit stand right there. Then room for our phone holder and our light and the strap all fits in there pretty snug. So you can fit your music stand, your phone holder and your light all in there. So there you have it guys. I can honestly say in terms of fold up compact stands. This is easily the most sturdy and well-made compact music stand I've ever used. And honestly, it's not even close. All the other ones I've tried before are just flimsy kind of junk that will just get knocked over and all your music's flying all over the place. They're such a pain. Um, but this is super sturdy. Thank you guys for watching. Again, if you want to check out the Craft Geek website, you can use my affiliate link in the description below. Just use code Mitch Avedon and you can get a nice discount on this stand. Thanks for watching guys. Have a great one.